start visual studio 2022 create new project and you can see there is no sp.net web application item in the list so click on continue without code and then go to tools menu and click on get tools and feature to install the sp.net web application click on individual component and write dotnet framework at the dotnet framework SDK targeting pack and uh, project and item template select and then click on modify yes it's installing click on continue yes it's installing please wait it's done now close the visual studio installer and close visual studio application now start visual studio again and click on create a new project and you can see the sp.net application.net framework it's added newly just select and click on next uh, select the directory the directory is uh, d drive select the uh, folder yes click on select folder and then name the application then create web form select web form and then create yes it's creating as you can see in the solution explorer the project is created let's check in the directory dj yes uh, web application 2 is created successfully now double click on default.spx yes this is the design and here in the main uh, main tag writing text hello programming geek yes it's added now let's see it's in view in browser yes hello programming geek is added in the default.aspx in some cases after clicking create new project you can see this window then double click on aspect application under the recent project templates rest of the things are same